easily craft a consistent AI influencer with full control over pose, expression, and settings. Let's dive in. First, head over to Mimic PC. Wait, what's Mimic PC? Mimic PC is this super cool cloud-based AI platform that gives you access to over 20 pre-installed AI applications. It allows users to create images, videos, and audio without the need for local installations with ready-to-use workflows for a seamless creative experience. Now, click on the workflow Pick the workflow. Select the hardware settings, and your workflow is ready to use in no time. <laughs> How the workflow works. This comfy UI workflow is designed to create or refine a consistent character from multiple angles, focusing on realistic facial features, posture, and expressions. It's like having a team of AI tools working together to bring your character to life. Here's how it all comes together. DeepSeek Janus Pro. Think of this as your creative assistant. It automatically generates detailed prompts for things like clothing, body type, background, and setting. Pull ID Flux. The facial detail master, refining eyes, hairline, and skin texture to keep your character recognizable from every angle. Open Pose. Control your character's posture and body positioning by recognizing the skeletal structure. Flux. The core engine that generates your character based on input provided by Janus Pro, Pull ID, and Open Pose. Cool, right? Also, this workflow is modular, meaning you can turn features on or off depending on your needs. This lets you balance quality and processing time. Let's test it. First, upload your character style image into the load image node in the DeepSeek group. Janus Pro will analyze the image, extracting details like clothing, body type, and background to generate a detailed text prompt. This prompt is then sent to the Clip Text Encode node, where it's converted into embeddings for stable diffusion. Next, upload a portrait image, a close-up of the character's face, into the Load Image node in the Pull ID group. This model restores over 90% of facial details, focusing on features like eyes, nose, mouth, and skin texture. The weight factor controls the level of detail extraction from the portrait. For high accuracy, set it between 0.8 and 1. Now, upload a pose image, like a sketch or reference photo showing the desired posture, into the load image node in the open pose group. Open pose extracts the skeleton structure, identifying key joints like shoulders, elbows, and knees. The strength parameter adjusts how much the control net model enforces the pose data during diffusion, helping your character's body align naturally. Okay, now the Flux model, the core AI engine. Here you can pick your image size. Choose how many images you want to generate. And here's where you can type your prompt, or simply let Janus Pro handle it with the detailed text prompt. Now, onto the case sampler node. It leverages the flux model to create the character image by blending positive and negative prompt embeddings, facial details from Pull IDF. Pose data from open pose and initial image or noise from create image or load image. Next, adjust the steps, which control the number of iterations. Typically, 
20 to 40 steps work well. Also, choose the sampler method. Euler is faster, but less detailed. Keep the seed fixed, and leave other parameters as they are. After the image is generated using KSampler and the Flux model, it moves to the Face Detailer node. Face Detailer leverages AI to sharpen facial features, enhance the eyes, smooth the skin, and refine details like eyebrows and lips. Next, the image is passed to the Expression Editor node, where you can adjust facial expressions by selecting options like wink, smile, and like that. Now, a couple of key settings to keep in mind. The denoise parameter helps control how much noise is reduced, which affects the clarity and smoothness of your final image. The B box, threshold parameter fine tunes the sensitivity of face detection, making sure you hit the right spots for enhancement. I've turned off the expression editor, so now you're all set. Once you're happy with everything, hit Q. All right, here's the detailed prompt for the initial image expertly crafted by Janice Pro. And over here, you can see the open pose extracted pose data. As shown in the video, the workflow now loads the main checkpoint model and moves forward, considering the sampler parameters. And just like that, the image is ready, easy, and fast. Now, simply right-click and save it. You can further tweak the expression using the Expression Editor node. Simply adjust the expression amount and that's it. Now, onto the final but optional step. The Super Upscaler node. This step enhances the resolution and detail of your final image for a high quality result. Just tweak the scale factor to your preference, whether it's two times, four times, or even higher. Plus, you can fine-tune the outcome with positive and negative prompts. And there you go, you've nailed it. Thanks for watching guys, I'm truly grateful for your support and warm hearts. Love you all, and see you in the next video.